Chief guest, the President of India, Sri Pranab Mukherjee, to give away the medals and prizes to the students for, for their academic excellence. And Dean may uh, present the awardees before him. Institute Gold Medal for the Best Graduate MBBS for the year 2011 is awarded to Savine Kapoor. He is also recipient of Delhi Medical Association Medal for Best All-Rounder MBBS Student and Satyanam Medal for Best Undergraduate in Psychiatry. He is also awarded six book prizes for academic excellence. Sorel Catherine Freeman Book Prize in Pediatrics. New Zealand High Commissioner's Book Prize in Community Medicine, Institute Book Prize in the subjects of Aesthetics and Gynecology, Community Medicine, Surgery and Medicine. <laughs> Sardari Lal Kanga Medal 2011 for Best MBBS Student in Microbiology is awarded to Siddharth Jain. Siddharth Jain is also awarded Institute Book Prize for securing highest marks in the subject of microbiology. <laughs> Dr. D.C. Bhutani Medal 2011 in Ophthalmology for the Best MBBA Student is awarded to Anurag Chahal. The Mohanlal Vig Medal 2011 for clinical research is awarded to Swastik Agarwal. <laughs> Dr. Bodhraj Sabarwal Medal 2011 in ophthalmology to the best postgraduate student is awarded to Maya Hada. Srimati Kripal Kaur Medal 2011 for Best House Physician is awarded to Navina. <laughs> Dr. Atam Prakash Medal 2011 in Surgery is awarded to Ankita Paar. Dr. Shyam Shar Medal 2011 in Radiology is awarded to Ankur Goyal. <laughs> Dr. B.S. Naran Medal 2011 in Biochemistry to the best MBBS student in the first professional examination is awarded to Divya Biochemistry and Physiology. <laughs> Dr. Jitish Nara Medal 2011 in Cardiology is awarded to S. Nagin Drabhupati. Venkat Rana. Venkat Rana is also awarded to the Chitra 
Medical Medal for Best BMC in Medical Oncology. Sanjeevni Medal 2011 in Anesthesiology is awarded to Pallavi Mishra. Medal 2011 in surgery to the best postgraduate student is awarded to Neela Kandan R. <laughs> Professor B. Murari Medal 2011 in obstetrics and gynecology to the best junior resident is awarded to Unnati Shende. Srimati Neelavati Salvan Book Prize 2011 in Obstetrics and Gynecology to the best junior resident for outstanding research is awarded to Raj Gopal P. Menon. <laughs> Manohar Lal Soni Book Prize 2011 in Neurology for best postgraduate is awarded to Bhavna Kaur. Dr. MMS Ahuja Book Prize 2011 in Endocrinology to the best EM student is awarded to Parjeet Kaur. <laughs> Dr. K.C. Kandhari Book Prize 2011 in Dermatology and Demiriology to the best postgraduate student is awarded to Divya Shishaki. Dr. Rakesh Dandan Book Prize 2011 in Gastroenterology to the best DM student is awarded to Venigala Pratap Mauli. <laughs> Mrs. Pramada Bajaj Book Prize Award 2011 to the best BSc Honors Nursing student in Community Health is awarded to Anju Paul. Anju Paul is also awarded the Madhav Das Vijlani Book Prize for securing highest marks in anatomy and physiology. <laughs> Soren Kathleen Freeman Book Prize 2011 in Pediatrics for the best undergraduate student is awarded to Devan Shubansa. He is also awarded Institute Book Prize for securing highest marks in the subject of pediatrics. Dr. N. C. Nayak Medal 2011 for the best senior resident in pathology is awarded to Rajini Yadav. <laughs> Professor V. Ramalinga Swami Medal 2011 to the best junior resident in pathology is awarded to Shweta Kamar. The H.D. Tandon Medal 2011 for the best undergraduate MBBS student is awarded to Ravi Sharma. He is also awarded Institute Book Prize for securing highest marks in the subject of technology. Soil Catherine Freeman Book Prize 2011 in Pediatrics for the best postgraduate student is awarded to Minakshi Botra. Harmony Charity Trust Book Prize 2011 in Otorhinolaryngology is awarded to Shuchita Singh. <laughs> and Sonians of America Book Prize 2011 for the best nurse is awarded to Bhivati Unika Samuel. Soviets of America Book Prize 2011 for Best Research Work by Nursing Staff is awarded to Anand L. Tiwari. <laughs> Dr. 
and Sonians of America Book Prize 2011 for Best Nurse in Community Care is awarded to Suman Lutra. Institute Book Prize 2011 for securing highest marks in the subject of anatomy is awarded to Anupam Gupta. <laughs> Institute Book Prize 2011 for securing highest marks in the subject of anatomy is awarded to Amanda Ann Davis. <laughs> Institute Book Prize for securing highest marks in the subject of pharmacology is awarded to Mandeep Singh. <laughs> Institute Book Prize for securing highest marks in the subject of forensic medicine is awarded to Ashi Singh. <laughs> Medal and Book Prize 2011 to the meritorious student of BSc Honors Nursing for standing first in pre and paraclinical subjects is awarded to Lynn Thomas. Institute Book Prize in BSc Nursing Post Certificate for Standing First in the Final Exam is awarded to Letha Monan. Sri Guram Ravi Ajar, President James, Minister of Health and Family Welfare. Professor R.C. Dekar, Director AIDS. Dr. Shashi Upadhava, Dean AIDS. Dr. Sanjay Arya, Registered AIDS. Distinguished guests, beloved students, recipients of degree and distinctions and prizes, ladies and gentlemen. I am very happy to be present at the 40th convocation of All India Institute of Medical Science. This institute is a tribute to the vision of Pundit Jagarlal Nehru and Rajkumar Yamrita Kau, who foresaw the need for an institution that can emerge as the trailblaze of medical education and research in the country. AIMS is also a living tribute to the faculty, staff, and students who have over the years worked selflessly to bring the Institute to its present position of preeminence. It is due to their efforts that this institution stands out as a beacon of hope and succor for the thousands <coughs> who throng its corridors seeking relief from their maladies and suffering. I am honored to have been invited to address the convocation of an institute with such growing credentials. Let me begin by congratulating the students and scholars for receiving their degrees and prizes today. The convocation marks the fruition of your hard work and your transition from students to professionals, from scholars to scientists. You now drawn the mantle of dissemination of the knowledge and skills acquired at the institution from your teachers and mentors. While you must rejoice and celebrate your achievements, you must also realize the enormity of responsibility that has been placed upon you. The baton of knowledge and skills that you have received and the values you have imbibed must be carried with the same spirit and yield as has been done by your teachers. This has to be a lifelong commitment and this is the only Gurdukshina 
your teacher, mentors, and your alma mater would perhaps expect from you. No other institute is so intensely watched by government, parliament, media, and by the public at large as AIMS, as they all see AIMS as a symbol of excellence in medical science. The country expects the institute, the faculty, and the students to live up to this illustrious image. AIMS must rise to be one of the 10 best medical universities in the world by the year 2020. <laughs> the target is ambitious, but not insurmountable. I charge you, the faculty, the scientists, the scholars, the students, and the staff to focus on this singular goal. Knowledge is the driver of today's world. While we stand at the cusp of greatness in several fields on the global platform, our energy and innovation, trust in the field of medical science is yet to scale the highest. To look upon aims to lead India to the frontiers of innovative solutions in healthcare, discovering new cures, harnessing existing and emerging technologies for affordable healthcare, and exploring new paradigms for preventing diseases and creating wellness. AIM should be a powerhouse of biomedical research and a role model for others. This role is germane to the institute identify as a biomedical science university and this places you 